It's 6.30 on a Thursday morning, and Sergeant Brian Gay of the Springfield Police Department starts it out like every other day, with lots of paperwork. He checks out the briefing board, which has the latest law enforcement bulletins from across the state. Looks like he's got problems. Oh, yeah, it does. Doesn't like authority. After a quick debrief from the overnight sergeant, it's time for the 7 o'clock briefing. This morning, he has five patrol officers, one motorcycle cop, and two community service officers. He starts by going over the activity from the night before. Jasmine Dawn Altman got arrested, born in 82. She's 5'8 and 390, and she was stark naked. Afterward, it's more paperwork, making sure the reports from the night before are in order. 26, 27, 28. He has 28 current suspensions on his driver's license in the state of Oregon. He uses the computer to track his officers as they leave on patrol. There's a map of the city and then it shows where all our cars now have trackers on them, so it tells me where all my cars are at all times so I can find out what they're doing. Around 9, he decides it's time to hit the street. Like all officers, he carries 24 pounds of equipment on his body, plus lots of gadgets in the Chevy Tahoe. He knows from first-hand experience that weapons are a necessity. 2006, I shot and killed a guy. He pulled out a pistol, and he was dumb, and I was better. Gay's been an officer for 36 years. He says the biggest change over his career has been the advent of political correctness and the end of straight talk. It's kind of hard sometimes to not tell people the truth, and people don't like to hear the truth a lot of the times. So long, thank you. Everybody likes a fireman. They come and save their cats, break their windows out, pour lots of water on them, they're all happy. They see us show up and they all go, Daddy's going to jail. Whose car? This is my car. Explain to me about the plates. After 15 years as a motorcycle cop, Gay can spot a traffic infraction within seconds. All right, be careful, thanks. It's around 10.30 when Gay drives to South 41st Court to assist two of his men serving an arrest warrant for meth distribution. Let's walk up around a bend and see what's going on. Nine times out of ten, Gay says, the subjects won't be at home. Today, though, they can hear someone walking on the other side of the door. Eli, open it or I'm going to boot it, man. Gay calls for reinforcements, and then he sends officers through a broken window. Unlock that door. Eli, come out with your hands up. He covers the garage door while the others search upstairs. That's when the cops hear footsteps in the attic. Yeah, I'll, I'm gonna call the I'm gonna call the captain. There is talk of calling the SWAT team, but eventually the man is talked down and arrested. Well, that was something atypical <laughs> of day watch. Soon the paperwork will start again. Go check the dispatchers. I'm gonna go have some lunch. In Springfield, Bob Shaper, KZI 9 News. <sighs>